Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, Binarly, which is a company that looks at security, has found an interesting flaw in PCs. And this doesn't affect just Windows. It affects any uh, PC that runs either Windows or Linux. It also affects devices that run on ARM. So this is kind of interesting. And it all has to do with one thing. So when you boot up a PC, most manufacturers will have an image. So depending on the PC you have, for example, you could have a Dell picture for the logo. And um, basically, the logo itself uh, can be different from PC to PC. So depending on what you do, you'll have a different um, image there on my Asus. I got a different one. Acer has its own big Acer um, logo in it and so on, uh, whatever it is. And, and that's why the vulnerability is called logo fail. So what happens with this is that it's actually quite scary because it's one of those flaws that when exploited is really, really at the basics of the PC, which means antivirus doesn't see it. And doesn't do anything about it and any security point or endpoint mostly don't see it also so this is really really something so basically how do you get this and how the the the, the process works of course access to the pc needs to be done by malware so the vulnerability uh what happens in there is that you get malware so if you're not careful that's why once again, you got to be careful. You get malware, and the malware will actually replace the logo with its own crafted logo that might look exactly the same, but underlying that logo is a set of code that is going to be parsed by the system. And what happens is that malware will actually be installed. And this happens at the very, very... Uh, basic phase of boot up and EFI boot up on PCs. So they've demonstrated the uh, binary company demonstrated, you know, how it's quite easy to do and actually how security doesn't work against it at all. And once again, showing you that there's no antivirus that works with a lot of things. Um, and basically it has to do with just replacing this image and it's a problematic thing because your pc always boots up with that so even if you would reformat and reinstall windows or linux you'd still be stuck with that image that just when it's being parsed reinstalls and reloads malware and, and does what it wants so it's kind of a crazy thing once again you know this is not to alarm everybody this is just to explain different ways that, you know, you can be exploited on your PC and that you should not rely on your antivirus. The way to stay safe, because I always get someone that says, well, how do I prevent this? You prevent this by being careful what you do with your computer. It's as simple as that. Make sure that it's up to date with all the security updates and just don't do crazy things on the internet and click everything you see and especially attachments and email. Be extremely careful because that's how you get it. It's as simple as that. And antivirus, don't go crazy over which one is better. None is that great. Uh, so it's really a question of um, just common sense when using a PC on the internet. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.